Hello everybody, it is me, Mr. Vince, and I hope you all have a fantastic day today. And in this video, Jailbreak has fooled me. Now what I mean by that is I did not hit level 10. Now before I do proceed on, if you guys have enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, feel free to subscribe as well, and please feel free to hit the bell icon to never miss a video. And thank you Glitchblocks for giving me the fidget spinners back, I really do appreciate it. Anyways, before I do proceed on, in today's video, I do want to mention that there is a new item available on Roblox. If you want to get it, the link is in the description below. This item has a special effect and will be available until July 8th of this year. So please get it quick because this item is completely free. But without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into today's video. I did manage to hit level 10 by the time this video gets published to YouTube, so nothing too concerning right there. But when I got my contract set, as you can see here, this is my current contract set before this video gets published to YouTube. But the problem is that the XP amounts were so bad. Now, yes, all of them were really good, except for one. As you can see, the Rob the Bank Without Dying contract was the only contract that failed me the most. I have to say, though, I was pretty impressed. I am close to level 10, but I was very disappointed when I saw that I was not level 10. When I robbed the bank, which was also my last contract, I was curious, I noticed right away that I did not hit level 10. I was very surprised because I thought I was originally going to hit level 10, but I knew that the XP amounts will fail me. I got a total of 155 XP from the contract set. So, Asimo, if you are watching this, please don't make it happen to me again. It's kind of crazy, and it gets crazier sometimes. So, please, Asimo, don't do it. Thank you. So, like I said, I did not hit level 10 because of the contract set. If the Rob the Bank Without Dying contract has been replaced by a 25 XP contract or a 30 XP contract, or even better, a 35 XP contract, which probably is impossible for a criminal to have, then I would have been a little bit happier. While I may not hit level 10 right now, but I did by the time this video gets published, like I said earlier in the video, I am still pretty happy that I am close to level 10. So I made this video to tell you guys that I did not hit level 10 and the game just fooled me. Basically, the random contracts generator gave me some very odd contract sets because the game does not like me that much sometimes. So Jailbreak may like you sometimes, other times it may hate you. It depends on the game itself. It might have a good attitude, it might have a bad attitude. But I'm not taking that literally, because it's a game. Living beings like us have attitudes, right? So anyways, Jailbreak has this thing called Random Contracts Generator. Every time your contracts reset, every 16 hours, with the exception of Season 9, which in that case, all the contracts you have reset every 24 hours, you get a random new contract. The contract cannot be the same one, so you cannot get the same contract. However, the only exceptions are free XP and rob the tomb without dying, surprisingly enough. So I will go ahead and wrap it up for today's video. And as always, my name is Mr. Vince. I hope you guys have a fantastic day today, and I'll see you guys in the next video.